Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here for the 9 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update. We're looking at the Dow down 280 in the futures at 33,546. Now, what's really important, as I see it, if the uh, support at uh, from the 23rd at 33,400 is pierced, that's not going to be a good sign because it's going to say, oops, we have to go all the way back to the 200 period moving average of 33,000 to test to see if that can hold yet again for the last month. It's been a fantastic springboard for a move up. Looking at the E-mini futures, the continuous contract down 43 uh, points at 39.89. Here you've got 39.70s as a really important support to hold. Uh, it's It got stalled right at the 200 period moving average. We've been talking about that for about a week. Uh, yep, once again it got stalled, but it did push out of the inside track repellent zone in the weekly charts. So this is a very important uh, end of week on Friday to see what happens. Looking at the QQQ, the NDX 100, trading down uh, 458 to 283. If I look at the NQ futures, uh, right here at 11,709, uh, the 11,670 to 11,563 levels are absolutely imperative to hold over the next two days. Uh, if, if later in the day the VIX index, which is at 20.22, starts to pull back and the uh, I want to see the Dow in this particular instance lead a rally rather than the Qs, uh, just because it's really important chart wise for it to do that, then the Dow only down 120 to minus or minus 90 after 145 this afternoon will be a good sign for Thursday. But otherwise, it could be a very ugly close. Looking at the, this is the NQ, looking at the RTY, which is the Russell 2000, sitting on resistance, uh, on support right now at 1879, down 15. It's actually holding pretty nicely. So 1845 to 1837, already key supports to hold for the uh, for the Russell 2000. Now let's go to gold. Gold was down, it's down 12 in 1923. This is what I've been talking about. This is a digestive phase in the higher level consolidation. So how it holds over the next few days, because 1890 is really important support on the short term. Looking at uh, bonds, US uh, bonds up a little bit, 8.30 seconds. Looking at crude oil, uh, crude oil is, um, uh, uh, well, crude oil is in a range in the lower range. Have a wonderful rest of the day. Stay tuned for Tommy for mar the market. Uh, 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 whoa.